What, are you trying to topple Goliath? The more of them we drag into the light, the more torches and pitchforks we're gonna see in response. You sure you want to compare your followers to a bunch of angry villagers? Yeah, well, no, man, but... The people are angry, and they should be. They're taking back what's hey, safe. Hey, hey. Just make sure you're pointing them at the right monsters. Right? Huh? Anyway, you get to go inside Titus and play with the robots. Oh, shit, when was this decided, man? Well, we did rock, scissors, and dynamite. Yeah, but I wasn't even there. No, but if it was a tie, you win. Wrench did paper, I did dynamite. Yeah, dynamite. Well, it's a regional thing. It's, it, technically, they cancel each other out, so... It sounds, sounds fair. And I sent him into one of the Titus warehouses. Now, he's got the delicate job of reading the fucking manual. <laughs> then you are gonna go to the front door, get the model numbers, and send back to him for the default codes. I will be nearby looking at blueprints and power plants. Yo, let's do it. All right, yeah. Happy hunting. Just a moment of your time. Cool. My turn. Junior's in. I need to figure out where I'm taking it. You're looking for the security hub nearby. Blueprints show it's a Everything. EMP protected Ready. by a Faraday cage. So it's not going to work unless you stick JR all the way in there. <laughs> off to one side. Oh. All right, Junior's in place. Everybody say night night to Junior. <laughs> the EMP worked like a charm, Ray. Yep. Call me pleasantly surprised. You had doubts? I always have doubts. Well, like I also have an excellent poker face, amigo. Not a skill, mind you, more due to years of rampant binge drinking. Uh, Ranch picked up Titus's default door code. 4545. Thanks. Huh. Titus 
Over here, I'll put it down! But technology is our passion. Taking a look. All right, I'm on my way to the server room. You should be able to walk right up to the database server now. Well, except for all the alarms, lasers, and guys with guns. Oh, that easy, huh? Thanks. Nothing to report. All right, Ray. Send it something your way. Oh, yeah. That's definitely something. You know, this is gonna take some time to parse. You should be close to a private lift in the CEO's office. My blueprint doesn't show where it goes, which means it's exactly what we're looking for. Damn, will you look at this place? She even got her own private elevator. on the data you sent me. 
Looks like Titus has the 10-year plan brewing in some kind of prototype lab. Aye, let's see what they're keeping in sub-level 6. And smash the shit out of it! What Wrench means is find and record evidence that Titus is up to something naughty. Well, if you want to get technical, sure. All right, I'm in a nuclear bunker slash parking garage. You got anything else on the prototype labs? Only that there's one thick-ass iron door in your way. No idea what's behind it if you get through. When I get through. One of our long-term goals for Titus Robots is to construct armor capable of withstanding the strongest ballistic attacks in a combat scenario. In domestic security situations, these new models will easily be able to withstand small projectile attacks, Molotov cocktails, and other improvised riot weaponry. Within the next two years, Titus will begin field testing assault and defense capabilities of our robots for use in both domestic and military situations. Featuring reliable accuracy and superior reflexes, our robots will provide safer alternatives to soldiers or security personnel. Titus Watcher robots have limited offensive capability. We plan to fit them for a much more active role in conflict zones over the next several years. We're currently testing damage resistance within urban suppression contexts. We're also in negotiations with Galilei to build walkers for their space program. People, I've recorded all kinds of ridiculous robotic shit down here. Here, you're not gonna believe it. Anything usable for the video? Titus and Bloom plan to put CTOS functionality into armed robots and use them against civilians. How does that sound? Yeah, all too familiar. What does that mean? Feeding big data through war machines was a wet dream of some of the blue concept grunts when we first were designing the CTOS. I made sure it got the veto back then. That's why you've been so involved with this one. Yeah. Yeah, I have my suspicions. And now we've got the proof to burn them. Head on out. Not done here yet. More to see. I'll be in touch. Guys. Guys, I can't even. Where's your fight? I can't even! Oh! Man, why does he get to play with all the toys? System online. Alright, I think I got this beast all figured out. Just gotta get it through these security doors. Any ideas? Listen, if you knock out the fire suppression system, the door should open as a failsafe. I can do that.
did it. Heading to the prototypes now. We've got a problem. Looks like the door to the backup servers is still closed. I'm on it. Knock the fuck out of the prototype while I work on the door. Counting on you, buddy. Find your way up to the backup server room on sub-level 3. Who needs elevators? Make sure you smash the shit out of everything. above my pay grade. Good, good luck. Fuck. Yo, Marcus. Check out all this Titus shit. It is like engineer porn. I mean, machine learning, nanotech, rail guns. Rail guns? Yeah, I thought y'all might like that. <laughs> this was a gift? Uh, yeah. Yeah. Well, damn, Ray. You're like some kind of greasy, foul-mouthed Santa. Ho, ho, ho. Merry fucking Christmas. Hey, you guys ready? Sitara's about to release the vid. Compared to other Silicon Valley Titans, Titus goes unnoticed. They do not put effort into their public face. They operate behind closed doors, away from prying eyes. Death's egg pride, and what we found should worry you. Titus is using your tax contributions to fund military-capable machines. Today, 
a combat prototype lab based through their own facility, demonstrating the destruction they can cause. Within the next 10 years, these machines could be deployed on American soil. If you do not exercise your right to protest them now, they will build an army to keep you quiet and compliant. Titus has partnered with Bloom to grant CTOS access to their machines. Bloom has sold your private information and weaponized it to use against you, should this project continue. We will not stand idle while that happens. DeadSec has given you the truth. Do what you will. Come on, let's go see what you scored before you get all the pages all stuck together. Hey, I'll catch up with you later. All right, later. I will arrest you if you persist. We've got some really bad news. Can you come in? What's going on? Marcus, you're all over the news. Homeland Security just put you on their most wanted list. The fuck? Better come to ground, amigo. An investigation has been launched to determine whether Invite Corporation, along with former Congressman Mark Thruss, attempted to illegally influence the congressional election. Evidence of their malfeasance was provided by the controversial hacker group DeadSec. As a result of their evidence, the election itself has been delayed.